Hi. Welcome to TJ and Jody's house. Hello, greetings and salutations, uh, friends and loved ones. Oh. Welcome wow. to our home, uh, our humble abode, uh. our palatial estate. Oh my goodness. Uh. Welcome one and all. Yes, welcome, welcome. Jody, hello. Yes. Hello. So good to see you. Good to see Looking you. Looking ravishing as usual. Yes. Oh, what I wouldn't do to look as beautiful as you do okay. every day without even trying. Yeah. You're such a queen. You have yes, a queen. Okay. Yes. You have a glow about yourself today. I do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday. Yeah. It's his birthday. Yeah, the day we're recording this is my birthday. It is. Not the day that it plays, but the day I, that it records is my birthday. I thought this morning I've been with you 27 birthdays. Whoa. I know. And I was thinking I had been with you 27 birthdays. No, I've been with you 27 birthdays. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Eek. We old as hell. <laughs> we are. Mm-hmm. Okay, so... Um, we are sponsored on the TJ and Jody's house by Josh's Farmer's Market in Mooresville, North Carolina. Mm -hmm. uh, Alexis went over there yesterday. Evidently, y'all had lunch together. And we did. She was running a little bit early or something, yeah. and she went to look at Josh's Market. Yeah. Yeah. And she said, it has, like, steak and chicken and stuff. It oh, has yeah. way more stuff than I yeah. thought a farmer's market would have. Yeah. They have but everything. She love it. I know. Who doesn't love it? But this Saturday coming up is the big, big one. We're going to be there for that because yep. it's like the kickoff of fall or something. Yes, because right? I guess the first day of fall is sometime next week. But this event is going to be the, can I, can I say the date? Yeah. Oh, okay. The 25th, September 25th. Yeah, we, I mean, we're not trying to hide it from them. We're well, trying to I get them to go. I never know what I'm supposed to say and not say. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so really, there is a Sorry. lot of stuff going on. Oh my god! That's why Jody's so got her computer out here. Yeah, but I'm gonna have to put on my big glasses because I can't see. Oh, you got yours. Yeah. Oh. That's how you know you you're an old couple when you can share reading glasses. <laughs> I was about to go here. Use <laughs> mine. You don't wear these. Though. Yeah. These are too big. Sugar britches. Use mine. <laughs> um, okay, so they're gonna have. Um, Hang on a second. Oh, my God. Well, I'm sorry. I thought it was up here. Mr. Todd, did I tell her I, like five times, be ready Todd. with this. Mm -mm. I'm staying out of it. Thank you. Um, they are going to have uh, the apple cider donuts. They're going to have the lobster truck. They're going to have... But uh, that's where they had lob lobster rolls, right? Yes. Not just... Which you know, I cannot They're not just going to like, throw I'm gonna, live lobsters at you or... <laughs> I'm going to get a lobster roll and then have an apple cider donut for dessert. Okay. And top it off with some pretty flowers to take home. And then they also have um, a company out there called Jaeger Snowman and Crafts, which we own two of the uh, signs they make. They make all these uh, wooden signs, and they do them for the holidays. So they're going to have the... A scarecrow, candy corn, pumpkins to Will hang they on do your the front snow, door. Snowmen's yet, or is that later? Uh, they usually maybe do that. I don't know. They may have them out there. Because we got they, a snowman that we have on the door, and, and it I, is adorable. Precious. And we have a heart. So precious. Oh, it is adorable. And we have a heart um, too for Valentine's Day. That's right. But I we do. Put a heart I would on love a little fall one. So I might do. God, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna get all kinds of things when we go out there. Well, I mean, we're not going to be out there all day, are we? I might. We oh, might better take another car. And so, uh, <laughs> Mr. Todd, I'm sorry, Mr. Todd from uh, oh, JT Media. Oh, his, I know, uh, Mr. Todd from JT Media. Because his fiance I got, I did. got off. No, she was sitting there when your fiance told us we needed to start <laughs> saying JT Media. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, and one more thing that I know. Um, if you like bluegrass music, they're going to have um, somebody out there playing from 11 to 2. Right. So that's all coming up this Saturday. Wood family tradition. Ooh, yes. I mean, we. And then they're going to have a kickoff. I mean, y'all, this just gets better and better. So they're going to have um, jellies, I bet. They're going to have um, pumpkins, fall decor. 
Mums. Oh, the Jellies is not the name of another bluegrass band. Straw bales. Let me line. Breads. Fall apples. You love a fall. You love a fall apple. Mm -hmm. uh, fresh seafood. I mean, everything. Y'all, y'all better come on out. Todd, next time I say, Chody, why don't you go get your computer so you can read off all the details? <laughs> on that. Remind me, <laughs> we don't have an endless amount of time. I'm jo sorry, Josh's but this farmer, is fun. Josh's farmer's market just got a, an infomercial. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Okay. Right. Well, I'm excited. So that is, it's all this Saturday. It's going to be a lot of fun. And, so fun. Uh, and yes, we are going to take separate vehicles. <laughs> Because I'm not I mean, staying out there all day. I mean, I love it. Me. I love Josh's and whatnot, but I, I just, you know, I got, I got things to do. You know, I'm, I'm gonna go through. What and not do? to mention, can you imagine the hysteria when they see me out there? All of those women look up and they're like, oh, and look, he's got a camera crew in tow. No, they're gonna, I can't. yeah, it's gonna be like those Southern Charm guys when they go places. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get security, the whole thing. Oh. Right. But uh, this Saturday, Josh's Market in Mooresville, it's uh, with the YMCA. It's on the YMCA grounds out there. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. Which stands for Young Men's uh, Christian Association. Oh, look at that. I think it still stands Side for note. that. Doesn't it still stand for that? Sure. I mean, it used to. I don't know where the, you know, new, new know. the new world and all that you're allowed to say Christian. I know. I know. Christian. Oh. Christian. Okay. So I have absolutely zero notes about what to talk about today on uh, TJ and Jody's house. So, uh, oh, well, I do know one thing that we need to, we mm. need to cover. Okay. Um, and then uh, it'll be a free for all after oh, that. Oh, okay. All right, more of TJ and Jody's house coming up, which I think is what this thing is about to say. TJ and Jody's house. At Team Stowe, we want to make the home buying process an enjoyable experience. Curtis, myself, and our entire team are here to help connect you with the best builders and realtors in the area so you can find the perfect time to make memories in. Contact us when you're ready to see how we can help. TJ and Jody's house. So one thing that we have to cover, I think, just go ahead and get it out of the way, is um, Jody is still getting upset by people who... Um, who are not happy with listening to the show and they're a little bit, I don't know, uh, rude about it. So rude. Uh, a lot of people are really starting to notice that, <laughs> that you don't care that much for me. Uh, okay, that was never said. It was said. No, it was what not. What did the guy say? Uh, it might be a girl, I don't know. Oh, um, I thought you said it was a dude. I don't know. They uh, said that your show was okay. Yeah, the Ace and TJ yeah, show it, was okay. It's okay, but geez, the... Uh, some all we are is bickering and i'm a dis, i'm the most disgruntled wife they've ever seen which is what i just said that you don't care for me you're no. disgruntled because you don't care for me no or the life okay i've provided you <laughs> you're not helping yeah but um yeah but we don't bicker all the time we're funny with each I, other and i really I mean, don't feel like we've been bickering on the podcast have we i don't know I don't ever listen to it, so. People, Mr. Todd with JT love, Media. People love you people Have we? Love people well, love yeah, I know that. There's always going to be that 1% of, you know. Well, yeah, I get it, but Jody's not used to people criticizing I'm getting her. used to it, though. Yeah, she is not used to criticism. But I'm getting used to it. All right. I, I, yes, I am getting used to it. Because you, everywhere you go, people are waiting there to tell you how great no, they think you not. are. No, they're not. I am not kidding, and it's always been that way. It's not, not that's just not since, true. Not just since she's been a superstar. No. Uh, you know, a famous personality. That's not true. A uh, reality, reality internet celebrity. I'm not. I'm not I mean, that it's like, girl, people, strangers, where did you get your little outfit? Who does your hair? Who does this? Okay. Like you? Um, nobody says that. Well, today she's uh, upset because Todd and I both said that her. I told her her hair looked fine, and then Todd told her something about the light was okay, and she said we were both lying to her. And <laughs> They're both liars. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Shut up. Your hair looks cute. <laughs> I can tell I your said, hair no. is not. I was saying, but your hair looks cute. My hair is just a mess right now. I'm just ugh. anyway. Why is it a mess? Oh, that's right. Because our our um. Our hairdresser had to take some time off. Yeah. And so. I'm just. Ugh. But your appointment wasn't going to be. F I know. Yet I'm anyway. a mess anyway. You're just. I know. I, I was trying to give you a, an excuse, but. It's okay. 
Hmm. We just all, girls have bad hair days. Yeah, but I don't think so. I don't think yours is bad. Thank you. Now, Todd said he thought it was. No, he didn't. He said, what is up with Jody's hair today? He did not. He was like, jeez. Todd and I discussed lighting. He said, I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to light around it, but. <laughs> <laughs> so are you disgruntled? No, I'm, I don't think I am. Hmm. Is this a good place? And whoever TV said that, uh, if they think that, then yeah, they don't know. know the half of it. No, they don't. <laughs> but we've been getting along really well. Like we always do. It's because I mean, you know, I don't like I don't like arguing and stuff like mm -mm. that. And so we just it's much better to not talk to each other ever than to argue, <laughs> which is more what we do. Yeah. No, but uh, since the kids have both been in college. We've been enjoying our time together. Yeah. Um, <laughs> for somebody who doesn't, you know, have a, what do you would call a formal place of employment, um, Jody always have, has been a stay-at-home mom. Uh, you stay busier than anybody <laughs> I know that works around the clock. <laughs> I mean, I'm sitting in here, yes, because I get off to work, I get off work early. <laughs> so, you know, I'm in here yesterday. I, I, I go work out now right after the show. Yeah, well, and so I get home about 1130 or noon, something like that. And what time did you get home yesterday? Four? <laughs> something like that? She was, uh, goes and works out at eight. And Three. then the rest of the day, Three. I mean, I don't know what she's doing. Stuff. And then when I say, oh, hey, where have you been? Mind your business. Because <laughs> I really don't want to go through a hole. Right. And you don't care. <laughs> you really don't want to know. No. But, I mean, as, I will as say... As long as you haven't been off with some man, I don't care what you're doing. There's been no man. But then you can just start saying... Uh, sorry, I got my gum twisted up. You can just start saying, um, I haven't been with a man, if that's what you're asking. And okay. I'll be like, all right. I'll whatever. start saying that. Because mm -hmm. I'm never with a man. I know. No. But, but I, I really don't. I have a lot I mean, of things to do. But, you know, I used to uh, come in and if you weren't here, I'd start texting you. Where are you? I know. Or then if the kids were here, I'd be like, where is your mama? I know. <laughs> Believe me, I know. <laughs> but it's just because I worry about you. Well, don't worry. I'm good. Being out there alone in this cruel world. I'm really okay. I just have a lot of things to do. Um, I mean... With building yeah, the know. house and stuff, and um, I don't know. It's just, I've had a lot going on. Whole and we've lot. talked about before, our builder is a lady. Mm -hmm. Her name's Martha, a.k.a. Martha. Martha. And um, come to find out, Martha says she's nervous about building our house because she's worried that you're going to talk about her publicly or something. She's not worried about me. <laughs> Uh, which is, you know, She's so not exactly worried. what I'm doing right now as I'm talking about her publicly. She's not worried about me. Yeah. But uh, I recognize that yesterday, whenever you say you've got to run out and meet Martha at uh -huh. the new house, uh -huh. that um, since both of y'all are women, mm -hmm. it takes a lot longer because y'all are going to talk a lot okay, more. Okay, well, let, let's go ahead. We're going to address this right now. We're, don't bicker. Uh, people, don't, people don't like it when we bicker. I don't care. I told you I'm getting used to people being not nice. So We're quarreling. Okay. Well, anyway, we did not talk or discuss anything but house stuff. I don't know how you think this house is going to get built without these questions from her that I have to answer because you don't care. Hmm. Yet you're nitpicking weird things while we're doing that. But there was no talking and visiting on the on the other than what was going on with the house and these things that had to be taken care of am i correct that sounded like gossip to me no but you did almost get thrown out the car before we even got there because you were griping as soon as we turned on the road and there was traffic you start complaining and i was like why did you why did i even ask you to come Jody. Jody, Jody, Jody. Woody, Woody, Woody. We're not going to quarrel. Yeah, listen. <laughs> We're not going to yeah. air our dirty laundry. No, I'm airing here. it. I'm in airing it. In front of everybody. I am airing it. But you know, maybe the, the people that think all we do is bicker 
uh, maybe they're not watching the video of it on YouTube. Maybe they're just listening to the audio and they can't see you smile when you're saying these things. Yeah, Because it comes across more as you being just a fun-loving, jovial wife when you smile with your big old teeth as you're saying these things. Mm-hmm. But I, uh, for the record, I'm enjoying our evenings together, just you and me. Because yeah. you're, you're finally home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am finally home. And um, last night, well, like two <clears throat> nights ago, we had, uh, didn't we have leftovers? Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, I had leftovers, and then you made yourself some of that turkey sausage that I don't like. Remember? Wait, no, 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 um, no, two nights ago we had, uh... No. We had that turkey sausage that I don't like. That was Tuesday. That you and I quarrel over. Remember we had that whole big thing when I told you that I didn't like that turkey sausage? Uh-huh. And oh, we had turkey that. burgers. I thought that was Monday. Monday night. we had turkey burgers. Tuesday the sausage. And what's today? Thursday. Oh. Two nights ago. Okay. Oh, my God. Sorry. Um, We're recording this on the Thursday. Yeah. And then last night we had, uh, each of us had a frozen uh, microwave Weight Watchers dinner. Yep. And it was completely fine. I love it. Because we'll be sitting here. I know. It's it's awesome. And we just say, "Mm, I'm not that hungry. Yeah, me either. Let's just eat a microwave dinner. Mm -hmm. Fine with me. Yeah. No clean up. No mess up. Eat. Go about our business. And we've been looking at this show called... What's it called? Manifest. Manifest. And we can get one episode into that before I have to go to bed after dinner. It's called Manifest. <laughs> if you've seen it, you know what I'm doing. <laughs> and Jody's like, I'm really not, you know, I'm not liking it so much. You know, that. So then as soon as I turn it on, she's like, look, <laughs> looking over the top of her. What is he? Wait, is he good now? Is he, you know. It kind of gets on my nerves a little bit. The acting's not great in it, but... Mm-mm. Our goal is always to find something we can watch together. I have a new one I'd rather try. What? Clickbait. It's supposed to be really good. Yeah. Y'all so then, what are we gonna do? Ted Lasso. We don't have we don't have your money, Todd. We don't have that Apple TV subscription. Thing. We don't have JT Media money. Uh uh-uh, uh, JT Media. Oh my God. <laughs> JT Media. <laughs> Uh, what is that on? It's, it's on, on Apple. Apple TV. Yeah. Lasso? It's a, Ted Lasso. Everybody says it's really, really funny. It's got Jason Sudeikis in it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But we don't have that. Oh. And you get you get Apple TV subscription uh, when you have a, when you get a new iPhone, which we haven't done since 99. I know. Yeah. I know. We so, need. but we, you know, we can't pay for that subscription just for that one show. Because I don't think anything else is good on there. Is there nothing else good on Apple? It's really good stuff. Mm. He's talking about that Jennifer Aniston yeah. show. Yeah. Show. Yeah, yeah, I heard good things about that. And C. C what? C, the show C. S-E-A or S-E-E? S-E-E. It's the guy, who's the guy that played uh, Mermaid Guy? What's uh, Aquaman. The guy that played Aquaman. Oh, Jason Ooh, Momoa. well, it might be worth it. Yeah. Is that his name Momoa? Yeah, something Momoa. Like that. Ooh. Jason Samoa. Momoa. He handsome. Yeah. He is. But anyway, <laughs> so our nights are that. And mm-hmm. then, you know, Jody sits right there on her end of the couch with her uh, computer in her lap, looking at TV over the top of her glasses. Yeah. I sit where Mr. Todd is. Uh-huh. And if Jody doesn't have to pause it so much to... <laughs> To um, take phone calls and things, we could get through an episode pretty quick. Who's calling me usually? I don't know. I don't pay attention. It's your Our business. Our little children. I don't try to, you know, I don't try to get into, you know, your private business. Yes, you do. <laughs> yes, you do. Oh, my gosh. Did you hear? I was so mad last night. Did you hear my phone go off at 1.30 in the morning? Yeah, because you remember I said, is everything okay? Yeah. Yeah. It was Lowe's Home Improvement to alert me that my shipment had gone out. Why would they do that? I don't know, but I'll show you. 1.30 in the morning. I believe you. It wasn't a man. Because I heard it. 
I wasn't a man. Mm-hmm. Um, but I, and then I, ta- and then I think, oh yeah, now I remember, because I said, I have it on Do Not Disturb, and it, because mm-hmm. only Do Not Disturb, I should get my favorites, which are the kids. I have it on Do Not Disturb, and this stupid thing's not working. Well, I, I woke up this morning, it and wasn't. I didn't have it on Do Not Disturb. Because I was going to ask that you, is why, is, why is Lowe's in your favorites? It's not. <laughs> well, it might be right. these days. But one thirty, they just send me that to say that, because it's a light I order. But, um, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Totally messed up my whole night. Yeah, I guess you couldn't hear me asking if everything was yeah, okay I, through my seatbelt. Yeah, now I do. I mean, I'm okay. <laughs> my seatbelt mask. Is everything okay? I was like, ugh. I'm so mad. <laughs> and you know what? I uh, commend you for being able to come to bed every night or get get awakened in the middle of the night the way you do and look at me in that CPAP mask <laughs> and not just be all over me. Just, I mean. Uh, it's hard. It's really a lot of willpower yeah. on your part, I'm yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Ugh. You know what it reminds me of? Do you remember? <laughs> Sometimes I look over there, and it reminds me of, um, was he on Sesame Street, Snuffleupagus? Snuffleupagus, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I always think, he kind of looks like stuff of life, I guess. Oh my god. Because <laughs> it goes, mm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm thinking about getting that thing that they implant in your throat that has a. Ugh. Or they implant it you know, in your throat and then it attaches, it's an electrode thing that attaches to the nerves. To, to make it where you won't snore. I don't like that. Mm-hmm. No. Yeah, because I really can't take a chance with anything maybe messing up my golden <laughs> voice. No, no. I just don't think that sounds good. Is that approved? Well, my doctor is the one that told me about it. Mm-hmm. My regular doctor, the one that's the one that we like. Yeah, I don't know about all that. What's up, Dr. Bundy? <laughs> <laughs> um, no, just keep the snuffleupagus thing going. Yeah, but it's uncomfortable, too. Oh, it I doesn't mean, look like it. <laughs> it's like I hate it. Hose I hate it. mask. I hate it. Mm-hmm. But I do think you are sleeping better with that. I know you don't think so, but you are. Yeah, and I get you used to, to be fighting the sheets and tearing them up. They're not. It's not like that anymore. I know huh. you don't think that you're sleeping, but I really do think you are. Uh-huh. Um, I do. And. Um, I'm still getting used to having a little extra time to sleep in the mornings mm-hmm. because for so many years I had to get up so early because I had about a 45 minute to an hour drive into work. Mm-hmm. Well, now I can sleep a little bit longer, but I still wake up thinking I've overslept. Yeah. So I've been waking up at the normal old time. Yeah. And all that. Yeah. It's torturous. But you're getting some torturous. more sleep now. Yeah. Why are you looking at yourself? Because I'm just then wondering what that view, that uh, angle of the camera looks like. He got, he changed yours because you requested it. Ugh. Oh my god! But and you know, I don't know. It's not an old. It's straight uh, ahead. Yeah, it's all right. <clears throat> Wait, go back. Look at that. Damn, that big old trap right there. <laughs> That's my shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I like your birthday blue shirt. Mm, thanks. It's cute. Mm-hmm. Uh, so we have like 27 birthdays that I've celebrated with you. Yes. Not that I'm going to be, you know, celebrating, partying or anything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not at my age. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's not a monumental birthday at all. I mean, 71 is no big deal. Because it would have been 28 birthdays, but right, we met the month after you had had a birthday. Yeah, we met at Halloween time. Yep. And you were wearing a costume. Yeah. I was. And um, because when we met was when I just showed up at random from answering that ad for the dominatrix. (laughs) I was like, wow, she's pretty young, younger than the rest of them that I've been to. Yeah. And then we hit it off. We did. Yep. (laughs) So good. Yep. So good. I was making a lot of money doing that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You may have to go back to it. I'm fine with that. 
whatever I gotta do. You just won't be able to hit people as hard <laughs> now, that you, now that you're old. I know. <laughs> you're just uh. like, ah, <laughs> take that, I need, you dirty my, pig. Take or I'll that. need my glasses to see where I'm <laughs> aiming. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we, we may end up having to be one of those couples that does crazy stuff, you know, when we retire. What do you mean? Such as? You know, like visit nude beaches and, um, you know, fly to faraway lands and, you know, do what they do yeah. in their culture. We don't even like looking at ourselves on these little cameras. Can you imagine if we... But I'm going to tell you this. Uh, no nudist people are ever attractive. Right. So if we went to a nudist place today, <laughs> I think I would I would be, you know, the eye candy for the ladies. Oh. <laughs> Even in the shape I'm in today. Because I always think that that's why they want to be naked is because nobody requests to ever see them naked. So they have to just go I mean, hats push, off it, to them. push it on to people. Yeah, like, well, oh, you're going to look at me naked. But they have to have some sort of confidence to do that. Yeah. Which I say good for them. Mm-hmm. Good for them. But, I mean, they're Everything. out there mowing the yard naked and stuff like well, that. Well, whatever That's, you got to do. That, can you imagine? No. You know, getting into a bed of ants or something? A bed of ants. I can't even imagine you mowing the yard with clothes on, much no. less without clothes. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, they must never fry anything at those nudist colony places. Right. Uh, nudist Maybe they have resort. a lot of a sunscreen. No, but I mean, even at that, if you're, you imagine frying bacon with no clothes on? Oh, I thought you meant their bodies. No. I didn't mean food. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, how are they going to fry anything without oil popping all over them and stuff? I don't know. Maybe they like it. That. I don't know. Uh -huh. I don't, let's move on. You don't have <laughs> body hairs in your food. And, yeah. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. That's gross. I don't want to talk about that. That is gross. It's nasty. So we're going out to uh, to dinner because it's my birthday. Actually, we go out to dinner every Thursday night. So it's not really because it's my birthday. We would still go. We always go out to eat for your birthday no matter what day it lands on. Yeah. I'm this not... is just the first year with no kids. Oh. <laughs> That's so sad. Hmm. You miss them? I think, yeah, I do. We're going to see that boy one this weekend. We are. i got to make him some pumpkin bread today. Let's see. Take. What do we got here? Um, yes, see, the girl one has texted me a little earlier. The girl one. And then, uh, oh, I just got a text from my brother, too. Oh. My wish is for you to have a very special happy birthday. He's such a little Hallmark card, isn't he? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, did you hear from your boy? Not yet. Oh. No, he's, he's been in class. Okay, well, he sent me a picture of his bagel. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but I didn't... I got the same picture. But, <laughs> but I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to embarrass him on here to call him out. Because, I mean, he could, he could text me, like, right after we turn the mics off. And the, you know, that, and then, and then if he listens back to it, he'll go, I did text you happy birthday. Why are you trying to make me look bad? No, he will. Mm. He's too busy. Yeah, I know. He has, what's today? Yeah, he has a lot of classes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's the opposite of you today because you have no class. Uh, zero. None. Zilch. None. Yep. All right, we got to take a break, so let's take a break. All right. Let's go. It's DJ and Jody's house on the Radio Button Network. What's Share Funny? It's a show from TJ that's funny enough to share on social media. Hear Share Funny live from 9 to 10 Eastern, 8 to 9 Central each weekday morning on the Ace and TJ button. Available on our app and now on iHeartRadio. Let's go. It's TJ and Jody's house on the Radio Button Network. All right. So today, what I'm about to do when we, when we wrap it up here is that I'm going to spend my birthday in the in the damn kitchen, <laughs> as my mama would say. Oh, I just need to get out of this damn kitchen for a minute. <laughs> um, because we're going to visit Boy at college. It's family weekend at his college, and his favorite meal is uh, jambalaya. If uh, if you are a person who has heard of that dish, 
and maybe you refer to it as jambalaya. It's uh, technically, you know, in Louisiana pronounced jambalaya, like jumbo, jumbo laya, jambalaya. Mm -hmm. But anyway, that's going to take me a while, and it will be delicious. There's no doubt about that. It mm -hmm. will be knee weakening delicious. It will. Mm -hmm. It really will. Um, let's talk about how I told you that I had to make pumpkin bread, and could I be in the kitchen doing my pumpkin bread at the same time you're doing that. Jody, let's not quarrel. And he goes, <laughs> and he goes, I said, all right. And I said, but you don't need an oven. And I'll just stay on my side over there. Yeah. I mean, our the kitchen in the, in our temporary house here is not that big. And I, I, you know, I, I do a lot of moving and, you know, I'm here and there and. I'll just stay over there on my corner yeah. by the oven. Mm -hmm. I have to make that, though. Yeah. I know. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. But you were supposed to do it yesterday when you were running the roads, beating the streets all day, and you were supposed to be doing that so you would be out of my way. Because obviously you recognize that it's it's not ideal for you to be in the kitchen no, I just baking pumpkin angry. bread while I'm cooking. You get angry. You get so angry. You get disgruntled. Because what I'm doing is real stuff. What? What I'm, <laughs> what I'm doing is real cooking. Uh-huh. Well, I'm doing real baking. Yeah. I mean, you could do that in a in an easy bake Well, oven. you don't bake well. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. Jody, please. You don't. I don't bake because I don't I don't like just following the same formula over and over. Well, but I, I can love do a it. list. I can do it. Yeah. Mm, he but. He can't do it. Hmm. But I can't cook like you do. But I admit it. Do you want to have a bake-off? Yeah, boy, let's do it. <laughs> oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. I'll bake-off. And um, when we get the new house, have we talked about this on the podcast? Yeah, yeah. Well, we get the share. Mm -hmm. When we get the new house and I got my new stove and stuff, uh, well, I may start doing some um, some cooking show t things on the YouTube. Which will be fabulous. You're a good yes. cook. But I mm -hmm. say you want to have that bake-off, we'll do that too. Okay. All right. Ooh. It's on tape. Hmm. Okay. Who's going to be the judge? Mr. Alexis. Todd? Alexis. Wait, are we going to, are we going to bake Alexis. the same thing? But we can't let each know of who us, did what, because she would e pick mine. Each of us bake yeah. something different. Like, I, I picked no, something. No, you got to bake the same thing. Oh, well, that's not fun. Okay, well, let's do. Well, then. Okay, we'll do something different. Yeah. Okay. All right, we'll let Alexis be the judge. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Jody. Yeah. You know what's going to happen? Woody. Is that you hang on to this whole thing about you being a better baker than I am yeah. and all that. And yeah. then when I win, you're going to be distraught. No. And you'll be like, well, oh, I see. No. I, I was mistaken all these years. I guess I'll just never bake again. No, because I'll just say, who wanna... cares? You can do it all I now. Know. I hate cooking. See what I mean? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I do hate it. it I would... don't mind baking, but I hate it will cook. crush your spirit, and I'm not I'm, a spirit crusher. I really crusher. think I'll be all right. I'm not a spirit crusher the way you are. I'll be okay. All right. Well, we got to go. Okay. Let's go. It's TJ and Jody's house on the Radio Button Network.